And as restaurants struggle, business is booming for one local chef who's serving up gourmet meals in the comfort of his very own kitchen. New tonight, CBS 13's Rachel Wolf is in East Sacramento with the thriving pop up restaurant. The chef who lives inside this cottage calls it a dinner series at the gallery. That's the name he created for this fine dining venture with his wife. Chef Josh Beaker preps for meals with a purpose. It's the structure, the precision, the organization of it. After nearly three decades of long hours working in restaurants, he took a risk. I knew I wanted an outlet. I knew I wanted to have full control. He opened up a pop-up restaurant in his own home, taking his culinary acumen and serving meals to small groups. My vision is that I want to sit here, I want to see what everybody, their experience. It can be intimidating sometimes because there's nowhere to hide here. Beaker cooks, his wife hosts. It's an intimate experience, people sharing a table for an eight-course meal. They don't even know each other or the dishes that will be served. Too. I've never had dishes that just pop in my mouth. Mark Abigan is one of many repeat clients. You have the relationship with the, with the chef. You get to talk to him directly. You get to talk to everyone directly. Authenticity and attention to detail are paramount. From the first course, an oyster emulsion with a Spanish jelly, to an onion cappuccino, then a scallop with miso and reduced citrus. Even the cocktail is made with homemade tonic. Design and aesthetic and everything else is very important to us. With years of food safety training, Beaker is confident in his abilities, but the county currently does not allow a restaurant to be run out of a home. That's why they only ask for a suggested donation of $75 and up. Well, if you're catering for weddings of 100 out of your house, there's going to be a problem there. But if you're cooking for eight people or 10 people, I absolutely think that should be legal. Because with the rising costs of doing business, including a higher minimum wage in the Golden State, he says it's something more chefs are considering. They book up to a month in advance to plan their menus, and first one to respond gets in. They book sometimes just minutes after putting out the word.